What is going on YouTube? We are live at Mammoth Mountain. It is opening day. I drove up here at 10.30 last night and um, there's already a few people in line but I was going to be able to get second chair so I got back out in line at 3.30 in the morning. Brought my mattress out, out onto the snow. Whoa, how do I hear myself? And, uh -oh. uh, there's uh -oh. already a few people in line, but I was uh -oh. gonna be We had a problem. I was hearing myself. Um, yeah, got into the line on the snow on my mattress with my sleeping bag at 3.30 in the morning out here. And uh, yeah, made it, made it on. I'm exhausted already. It's like been up since like 3 30 is really made it a full day Whew. i was just walking to my car to drop off my um insta 360 camera i've been filming on that and we just did the uh beer opening day beer toast up on the sun deck where they say thanks for coming blah 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 we're from Mammoth. yay another year and then we all cheers the Mazda 360 filled up right before that happened. So I shot it the best I could on my phone, but it was like the deck was packed with people. So it would have been so cool having that aerial shot looking down. I really blew it. So I just brought the Insta 360 to my car and I'm walking back to the mountain. Gonna get my board and uh, I go on some runs with you guys. Ricky is in the chat. He says, yo, I'm looking to swaggy. If you can see my sweet pants. Styling out. Everyone in the chat, let me know if you uh, if you're coming out here to snowboard soon. When's your first day gonna go? We got the lovely, the most beautiful Mammoth Lakes police here, enjoying some sun, enjoying a good day. Why does it say message held review? Oh, uh, Nate Webster sent a whole bunch of emojis. I will approve that. That is okay. Thank you for the 99 cents. Let's celebrate their first super on a live stream. Yeah. Here, I'll show you guys all the people up here. Look at that. Chaos. Wow, it absolutely looks like madness up there, actually. Kind of sketchy. We're going 
investigate that. It is right out. So I'm getting wrinkles on my forehead because I'm always trying to squint in the sun. I'm also doing a challenge right now. I wanted to see if my glue on nails could last through a day of snowboarding. I'm down to this one. So I'm down three nails at this point. I do not want to be in that crowd of people. Who else is in the chat? Let me know where you're from. If you're watching this, drop in the chat where you are watching from. and drop if you were going to be going snowboarding this season. There's really no garbage can up here. Oh no. He literally lost his key on the takeoff. I swear has a piece of metal sticking out from the floor of my this madness. Way too many people. 
who's going to collide. Wow. So many people. I got rid of my face mask because it was starting to warm up, but on the chair it's chilly. Ooh. Oh, dang it. What could I do now? Oh, I guess I've got these nails. I'd be like, yeah. Thank you. Can I ask where they're from? Um, it's like it's they're not snowboard pants. It's like a random like fashion company. Oh, are they like water? Um, no. They. Well, maybe it doesn't matter. I think sure they're. Fall, I think fall. they're water resistant, but they're like super thin. So like, if I fell like on a rail, I think they would rip pretty instantly. Uh, well, then you won't fall on a rail. Yeah, right? that's the plan. <laughs> All right, I've never ridden while live streaming. Let's see how this goes. I wonder if when my phone turns non-vertical, if it like stops the stream or just shows the stream sideways. Can you guys tell me? Did you see my sick air? Or did it just stop the stream? Oh, here's a little side hit. Uh -oh. Okay, this is the chaos danger zone. And I did not fully tie to my bindings, so I'm gonna try to dunk that down. Here. Ooh. All right. Are you ready? All right, it's a little bit chundery over here. Whew. Oh gosh, there are trees. Oh, I just hit a rock. hit this first feature because I'm going to investigate if there is a burr in the metal that I got There is kind of a... There's too many people for me to look at it long. Uh oh. 
phone. Oh no. You good? Everybody's falling into that hole. Oh, couldn't squat it out. Is this good? Should I just film people eating it in the park? All right, let me move down to one of the rails. I'm gonna hit this next one, and then, uh, then I'll go by the rail. front of me to then hit it really slow. That was very interesting. Woo! I almost just caught my edge. Holy moly. That was really interesting how that guy like cut in front of me really hard on that box and then like checked super hard and went slow. I was like, I'm like, you did not need to go in front of me because then I almost hit him. Uh-oh. Let's find out if my cross works yet. No. I'm on a uh, live stream right now. Oh. We're YouTube live. Hi, YouTube Live. Keep we handled the chair last night. It was super cold at midnight. <laughs> Say hi, Ava. <laughs> no, wait, you need to bring back. You need to bring back the Chip and Dale gloves, dude. I had those in my parents' house still. I gotta bring them out here. You're right. I miss my Chip and Dale gloves. They were fun. You're on, you're on live. We're off and we're out of breath. I'm snaking so hard. <laughs> How many people are on right now? <laughs> we got 18 people watching. It was 23 like a second ago. I think we were popping in the middle. 
everybody's here. Yeah, it was kind of funny from the chair, just like the main run has gotten so packed. Like I can't believe how busy it is on there. When I like zoom in on the camera, it looks insane. I kind of I wish it was a stream because I want to get a sideways shot of like zoomed in of just like all the people. But I gotta stay on the stream for another 40 minutes. Well, I gotta say something. Shout out to Jenny. My daughter's is just one of them, one of the numbers. She got a place down with Ben and PJ and got them all hooked up throughout the time. We met six seasons ago on Channel One and it was amazing. Always good. Always just jumped in with the kids and beautiful, beautiful person. No lie. No joke. Always stuck with them and loved so much. <laughs> you did. What do you say? They're your little minions? My minions, yeah. yeah right. But now they're not my minions anymore. They're both taller than me. Right. And no joke, no lie. We've always taken care of them. We look up to you. Thank you. And you always reach out to your troopers. You say hi. Even on the off season. It's really important to us. He does the homie. You're a trooper. There comes Drake. Oh, over under. You remember when we did the over under? Yeah. On a, it was in South Park on the rainbow. I think both you and Leah went under the rail. I tried to go up to that first feature to like investigate and see if there was like something sticking out. Is it? But like, well, there's so many people coming through the park that I like couldn't stop and like look at it. Like I like tried to slow down and like run my hand on it and then there's just a million people coming. Who's gonna fall? Who's gonna fall? Back in Amethyst, it's just like amazing. The adrenaline's still going. It's like full 24 hours. I think I got like two hours in the Dude, I went up for the, the champagne toast and I had my 360 camera and I had it on the phone and I stuck it way up I above everyone's head. And then my memory card filled. And so I didn't get the shot of the actual toast from that angle. I was so bummed. I was like, that was the one shot I wanted was like everybody going, woo, and then like. And so I took it on my phone. I don't think it was as good. Somebody handed me a beer and I was scared to drink it because it wasn't like on the tray. <laughs> yeah, someone's trying to get you. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Someone's trying to take you home and have their way with you. Do you see this rock drop right here? Yeah, do you see that? It looks fun. A little flat landing, but fun. That was not what I wanted to do. Right where I was going to take off suddenly, I saw like a rock sticking out. I got sketch. Yeah, get it. Oh, shit. Dang, what for the 180? Was that an accidental 180? Uh, no. That was on purpose. Wow, nice. <laughs> Sent it, first try. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, they're like not even moguls or full. I'm just like knuckles now. and then I'll tell you something. Shrug Kabua says hi. Nate Webster says nice. Got rock hands from H7 Opolo. And then he said already snowboard in the season. Wow, yes, this is Mammoth's opening day. Some shock ups from Nate Webster. Bluefish. Watch reviews. Hi, Janice. Where's the Rickster? He is in. Who's in San Francisco right now? Um, skateboarding with Braille. Someone said, somebody's gonna fall on one of your nails. Yeah, it's gonna take someone out. H7 Opolo says, May no boarding. Yeah, I don't think East Coast has gotten their snow just yet, but it's coming soon. Michael Mallory Show, St. George, Utah. I think Utah has been getting some snow. Ooh. Just bluefish. Florida, 88 degrees today. Yeah, it is, I think like 50 something here today. It doesn't but feel like it. <laughs> that's the thing is like when you're at this altitude on the snow, like 50 degrees feels like 80. Like this is a hot day. It's crazy how different the temperatures feel. Um, Maxi, Austin, hopefully goes home. Yeah, I just realized I have so many comments. Like none of them are auto scrolling, so I didn't think anyone commented. Now I'm seeing answers to questions I asked like 20 minutes ago. I'm like, ah, rookie move. Okay. Uh, Nate Webster waiting for Boyne Mountain to open December 15. Jay Garza says he's in Germany and Austria. Uh -oh. Time for my pass. That doesn't work. Do -do 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 -do. I don't know. I don't know why it's not working. Are, are you a master? Um, no. Gabe Taylor gave me this for work. Oh yeah. Apparently the master is like. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, you just like, you just don't care. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, Maxie, Maxie says the snowboard pants. Yeah. It's actually off, not even snowboard pants. Like it's going to be slippery. It's going to be a little Maxie, scary, crowd looks not. hyped in a beautiful day. Yeah, it is nice day. Nate Webster, 38 degrees in central northern lower Michigan. Right. Central this northern lower Michigan. Michigan. That was three different locations in one. H70 Taro Libra, I don't know what that is. Keep going, Rush. Let's get it. Andrew Johnson says, Good luck on your run today. Then I hope to see you at the Olympics again. Yeah. Me too. I hope to see you at the Olympics again too. P.S. Can't wait for it to snow in Wisconsin. I'm giving up for it. Alright, let's go. And good luck on your run today. Yeah, I'm just yeah. losing the day. Today is just one day. H70 says, Frame rate is stable at expensive video. Oh. Uh, Hopefully not, they're gonna come down here. Johnny Santos says horizontal looks better. Yeah, this is just a new thing with YouTube that I'm trying out, these vertical videos. I'm kind of in a test program where they're supposed to be discoverable, um, like TikTok. Let's see, what else we got? Hey, what's your, you leveled up to level one. Oh, Botrick said that. Oh, okay. 
What I was wondering. Acid Helms says hello. Sammy Bordelaz says, Are you snowboarding? Gary Spring says, Can't we try snowboarding next month? Use escape, we can't now. You guys, how far behind am I? Oh, okay, I'm caught up now. Tommy Gonzalez says, Do flip. <laughs> Arthur Black. <laughs> Vasquez says hi from Steamboat Springs, Colorado. Drancy, how do you like the Disruptor? I picked one up at the Peak Life. I picked up one of their Peak Life Yup boards. So just try a few of these. I don't know what Peak Life Yup is. Um, I'm not riding the Disruptor right now. I'm riding a Santa Cruz board um, that is extinct because Santa Cruz doesn't make it anymore. But. Um, Oh, this guy's going to be pretty. What's he going to do? What's he going to do? Ooh, backwards. He's going to do something. Um, but I do like the Disruptor. It is a fun parkour. I rode the Disruptor for, I think, like two seasons. That's um, cool. It's kind of a wider board for me because it's a men's board, but I like the wideness. I felt like pretty stable on it. Wow. Sasa says hi from Serbia. That is a long way away. Hello from Mammoth. Hello from California. Jason Jenkins. Hello, Janice. Looking forward to this season. It's about time for Mr. Nafton to start dropping vids soon, too. And then you're going to see. Oh, I saw it in your goggles. Must have been someone else. Yeah, maybe some. Oh. Keith is on the disruptor. Yeah. It's a wonderful yeah. board. Yeah. I've got the same one. It's a stiffer of a fill than the park, but um, I love them both. I love them both. <laughs> choice, I don't know what choice I'd make. It's such a hard choice. It's a little more flexy to park with. Are you going to hit that rock drop again? Yeah, I'm done. That is a flat Where is Serbia? Is that near <laughs> Egypt? Serbia is, that real close? is like in like Eastern Europe. Okay. Uh, I don't know exactly what it's between. Is it? Yeah, it looks like I'm such flat land. I'm I'm doing that air up there off the side. It's that rock because it's like you kind of land in that flat spot, like right. Yeah. Or you have to go fast enough to go past it. Uh -huh. That looks really flat. I don't know if my knees want to deal with that. We got a crawler. We got a crawler. Crawling away. Crawling away from the chair. It's actually fun to live stream because like I just catch so much stuff that like I'm always seeing stuff out here like people eating and then I'm like oh I wish I filmed that. But if I'm on live stream it's just getting it all. Way to get up to my head is gone. Maybe I can go up here with you. Let's see. Ooh, he's scooting through. Excuse me. Past key. Gonna drop key. That felt good. That was a nice air. Oh, flip. Oh, and he's down. Missed the flip, but caught the fall. What a moment in time. Here comes Ava. Yeah. Did it. She did. Good luck, Mr. We're out here. I'm so happy to be snowboarding again. It's just so nice. Like, I love skateboarding, but I'm not good enough at it to do the things that I wish I could do with snowboarding. I can have a dream and do it, which is really nice. Yeah. Yeah. I can do whatever I dream of when I'm on my snowboard.
Andrew Johnson said, let's go for another great run within the beautiful start of your beautiful season. I actually, I'm not going to go right here, so I got to get to this. This is where everyone's out of control. I want to be a casualty of someone who's out of control. That is my biggest fear. Is someone who's out of control hit me? Dude, I just hit three rocks. I just need so many rocks. So when I get to this kind of room, but yeah, I don't want to be someone else in college. Keith, you gonna do a trick? Oh, you're doing tricks now. Let's see. Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not to get hit? Oh! I'm in. Tap in. Tap in. gone soggy. Whoop. That was a bailout that I should have done. I should have just hit it. It's hard to film myself though. Ah! It is very hard to film from the perspective of this because I can't go wide angle. Are you hitting this? Yeah. Are you alive, Keith? Yeah, my legs. You want to you want to get me on a, a nose press on this? Of course or I do. I'll tail press actually. Of course I do. Let's do a little baby tail press. We're live. We're live. Get the iPhone and what I'm doing with this. Oh yeah, I see it got lower. That was fully pressed. My first trick on the stream no. from not my POV. Yes, I can. Oh, just like that. If I had seen them do it first, I would have gone for it. It's okay. You can look the other way. <laughs> we are in the wrong line. We ended up in singles. Alright, call me catch it now that I know they exist. Alright. I got DBC Ash send me the daily blessings coming. Ricky says do a kickflip. That is not something I can do on a snowboard, but Ricky can do a kickflip on a snowboard. Yeah. Like I'm buying it midair. Nah, he just did a flat ground. Oh, like, oh okay. Like flat ground stood on it and like Use the heel cut basically. I think we need to do like the snow skateboards. Yeah. Um, BBC Ash says, damn, nice grind. I don't know which grind we're talking about. It's really hard to tell if I get it in the car. Um, but I guess I can like go through the stream later and watch it and see what I actually got in the car. I might have Keith filmed some more of this run. Oh. <laughs> um, Andrew Johnson goes, just curious, what's your take on step on uh, step ons versus strap in? Um, I have not tried the step ons. I just did a video like about kind of a uh, review thing about the step on bindings. And so I learned a lot about them and it seems like the tech is super good. I just have never tried it. Um, besides the tech standpoint, it gives you allegedly a more like surfy ride, like you're not as secure. Like I like my binding stuff, I put like lock on, like solid to my board and the step ins you get a little bit more like freedom and so if you like the like surfy movements, it's good, but if you like to be like well, super two, attached. Just two here. Uh, my um uh we got uh hold on I got a bit. Cole Kogan says I eat Um, H70 Polo called out to stay in the live. Mayim says, what board do you use? 
Um, I'm kind of in between boards right now. I'm trying out some different boards to see what I want to use. Um, I'm riding this old Santa Cruz today, but I'm going to try out a Never Summer tomorrow. BBC Ash says snowboards don't kick up. If you think that, you gotta go see Ricky's video. Ricky Glazer did a kick on a snowboard. Yeah, he said kind of like pressure to flip. That's kind of what it was. Andrew Johnson, if it's what you love, it doesn't matter how good you are at it. It just matters that you love it and that you're willing to dedicate part of your life essence and your time on the earth. That was very spiritual. What do you think of that, Keith? What's if it's that? what you love, it doesn't matter how good you are at it. It just matters that you love it and that you're willing to dedicate part of your life essence and your time on the earth. Yeah. I'm a publisher. Oh yeah? What? Yeah, I got a lot of poetry. I like that I one. never that's, knew that. That's, that is that is a great one. If you because I thought about that too, like like for people with hobbies, like I've always been like a competitive person. So when I do something it's like for the purpose of like getting really good at it. But like a lot of people have hobbies that they're like, I don't need to be the best in the world this thing. I just like to do it. Yeah. And like that's good and healthy, like to just do something because you enjoy it. My, if you're not good at it. Yeah. My favorite people to like snowboard with in the world are the like the newcomers are so excited. It's the same as skydiving, like people that do tandems, they jump with the tandem on their chest just so they can get the new experience. The old experience that they're not But I know about, I know myself, I, I know the vibe of Denise because I know New York. We still hold on to the same Look at us in the snowboarding. Yeah. I get. <laughs> I'm prone to get frustrated with snowboarding. I get, I get, if I'm just cruising just for a lot of like, I'll just 50-50 every day. I'm happy yeah. just 50-50 all day. There is a vibe that, um, cause you, Ava finally got to do a competition with you and my old ass went to do a competition with her too. Um, and it's just, cause I don't compete. And I did with you a couple times last year. And um, it's, you learn new stuff. It's super fun yeah. to be in a competition. Yeah. It's not about winning. It's like, yeah. You know, it's, it's, that's, it's, it was so fun. That's why I, I always like progress the most in rail jams because I'll like do the tricks I can do or there's like tricks that I'm like scared to try but I go, well, I have to try it now. Like I have to go for this because I'm in a contest. So it like pushes me to like take that risk out where on a normal day in the park, I don't need to like push myself that way. Yeah. So once it's a contest, I'm like, oh, I got to send it. I just realized next run, I should probably give the phone to Keith up here so you guys can see this like side hit I'm getting. It's so fun. Oh, I almost just knocked another nail off, but it stayed. Ooh. And it's so hard to strap in with one hand. There we go. Every time. Wait, can someone tell me in the chat right now when I turn the phone like this, does it stop the screen or does it just look sideways? I'd really appreciate knowing. Hey! Wow! The babes! Ooh, yeah, we're, we're on the YouTube yeah. live stream right now. We got breezy love. FDOH baby! Where's the yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your pants! Those are so sick! They're fashion. Yeah. yeah. They're, they're not they're not snowboard pants. They're literally like paste and gold and will rip in my phone. <laughs> Those are rave pants, dude. Should we go to the rave on the, at the bar yeah, down there? Please, I'm ready to park. And I got like my like, easy like, kid hat. <laughs> I'm just super cool. No cuff. She got no cuff on that hat. This I is see like you. a trend looking like you got stuff from like 90s Walmart. Oh, That's the 100%. Thing. Yeah, I'm glad I'll, you're here. I'll see you in the park. I'm so happy to see you guys. Ooh. Ooh. Here we go. Can we? Oh god, that was a different spot than I hit last time. That was not it. Every single time I go off of it, I hit a different spot, and that was not it. <laughs> Whoops. That's the thing about snowboarding, though. You can always take another run and do it again. Okay, this guy's gonna eat it. She did. She didn't do the rock drop. I was waiting. It's okay. I wonder if they can see how big I go on this side hit too. Oh, I got it. Wow, holy crap. That was like, 
That was, that that was, was so tall. chaotic. Right? <laughs> that was a little out of control. That was out <laughs> <laughs> I was like was trying good. I was trying to avoid that skier at the same time. <laughs> oh yeah, I hit like ten walls over there. Oh okay, A simple is that the safety portion goes without dropping like it. I wouldn't be surprised if I got something going on there, but... <sighs> Vinny to the K, when did you make this old JS Smiley Face channel logo? It's on the bottom right of the stream. That's yeah, been on my YouTube channel for like years now. All right, Keith, Keith, what's your line? Oh, they have the thing I want to hit close. No. Aww. I was gonna do the mid-run phone pass off with you again. Me and Ava's his legs are just oh dead, but I'm gonna try something anyway because I can't land it all day. You don't laugh at me. Oh my god, can be It's sketchy. It's hard to balance my arm in the air. Let's see what Keith's gonna do. Okay, the tail tap. This is the trick he's going for. The cap one, two, seven. Oh, he wants a pretzel too, that's why. That's what he's going for. Should I hit this rail still? Uh. We're on YouTube Live. Huh? This is Audrey Pro Park Summer, YouTube Live. The people are watching the madness go down. It's badass. Holding it down for the ladies on park. <laughs> yeah, baby. Fingerboarding. Oh, I missed it. I tried to fingerboard that, but I missed. Shoot, should I hit this? I don't know if you can even see it. Here we go. Oh. Hopefully that showed up. It's just so close. I wish I could get fish eye on here. the shot worked at all but we're doing it all right switch 50 50 because i hate switch 50 50. Ah! Oh, i forgot about this ah! oh my god oh my god <laughs> i almost went into that tree I'll give you the stream. I just like shot myself hitting the rail to get me in the I'm like, I do not know if I even got the rail on it. Right. Vinny to the case says, no, stream safely. Huh? Uh, August 1st was my last time. Yeah. I think I stayed till the first to have August in the book. Uh oh. Uh oh. Our legs are hurt. Daniel, on the YouTube live stream. Hi, Jesus. Say hi to Coach. Name is Coach. What year is it? Oh, it's a brand new one. Still, I Still! Still, it's been a long year. You gonna do some tricks for the stream yeah, later? I'm tired. I just woke up. Oh my god. I've been up Parking since 3 o'clock. Hey, you slept right there. Right. I gotta catch up. Are you tired? Watch it not work. I 
Okay, I do this down pretty good. Oh, it is hot. It is 50 degrees, but it is hot. Uh, Vinny to the K says, when, oh, wait, I already saw that. The old icon. I don't know why it chooses old icons. No, that's just like permanently in the ball of my YouTube videos, I think. Vinny to the K says, do a grab. Ra Raul says, I've tried snow more than last year. I found it's not my thing, actually. Oh, you just gotta get used go. to it. You gotta try it a few Are times. you holding up well? Yeah. He says, I, oh, I love the atmosphere and culture of snowboarding, though. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's, it's like a lifestyle sport, they say, like, you can, like, go snowboarding. Like, oh, yeah? You don't even necessarily have to, like, snowboard the whole day. You can just, like, oh, come to the lodge. And, like, yeah, maybe you go for, like, one or two runs. Here, let me oh, let's go on the end. Uh, yeah, there's, like, a whole culture here where, like, you can be part of the snowboarding, even if you, like, don't actually snowboard. Penny did a case of little bump to tree slam. Yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to keep everything in the frame while I was almost falling, but like there were a whole bunch of little trees that I almost got taken out by. Michael Hacken today says tips for riding switch. I'd say try to just trick yourself into thinking you're going regular. It's gonna feel super awkward at first, but like when you were riding regular in the beginning, it felt awkward and difficult. So just like make like force yourself to go through the awkward, difficult phase and um just be like no i'm gonna keep doing this and then eventually it'll feel as normal as real. like i read the chair switch, and at first it felt awkward and now like riding the chair switch is like not at all so you just have to keep doing it until it feels regular and treat it like in snowboarding you can treat your your switch riding exactly like how you treat your regular riding like do you try to mimic every move you do the exact same way if any of the cases she's even working from the olympics right oh for the yeah, um, well, I went to Paris to do a training program for the broadcasting and hold on all you want to know. Um, I will be going ideally to the Paris Olympics and I'll be working in broadcasting. So like shooting the social media content, video stories and stuff, which is cool, except they told us if you're working, you have so many restrictions on like what you can actually post and take pictures of. And like, I am not going to be able to actually personally share anything, which is kind of a bummer. But at least I'll be there. And then skate says hi. Nay hey, Webster, feeling ha ha yeah, dude. Oh, oh did someone just eat it? I missed it. See, I gotta be filming the features as I go over them. Dave says, this is where you fall coming off the lift. So no, like I've oh, like I've basically 99% of every chair I've ridden in the last like 10 years has been switched. I rarely ride regular now. Now when I ride the chair regular, I feel like I'm about to fall off. Like it's like sketchy when I ride regular on the chair. Rose says, for some reason it was easier for me to ride and switch dance on snowboard, not to ride. Well, maybe you're goofy on a snowboard. Maybe. Some people do have opposite stances. I know some people who like skate regular and snowboard goofy or like vice versa. So maybe you're natural the other way on the snowboard because you do control it differently. Are you going to hit that knock drop? Yeah. Well, I think I'm. I'm not gonna do the rock. I'm gonna do the side hit at the top, and then he can come around to the rock. I hit every time. Every time I hit that side hit, I hit a different spot, and like one time I got a really good spot where I got a good pop and good air. And now it's like every time I ride, and I'm like, where's the spot? Where's the spot? And then I'll go off the rock and be like, nope, that was a pop. I'm just probably straighter. Okay. Here. Wait. I'm gonna flip this. Okay. I'm giving you the device. All right, I will not drop this iPhone. I will not. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do this like side hit thing on the top that I've been airing off of. Okay. Where, like, oh, right yeah, yeah. Where he's dropping. Yes, she will. She, she's going hard. I hope I could get this for you guys. I'm a GoPro filmer. Not an iPhone filmer, but hey, can't be that hard, right? All right, strap it in. I have to promote these freaking Union bindings. I bought them fair and square, but they're fucking awesome. Union bindings are fucking awesome. Okay. 
Let me see. She's gonna come over here, bomb off this crazy side here at some point, and hopefully I'm not in the way and get nailed. Here she comes. Woo! There it is. She had a lot of traffic. It's not you, the it, spot I wanted. Yeah, it wasn't. Kind of, it's all ate up. I had to avoid it because I don't know where this ball was that I got a good hit before. And there, oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's a lot of traffic. That, I think that collision was almost on camera. Right. The almost collision was on camera. Holy moly. Did you realize you almost, like, collided? Okay. Yeah, we had some cross traffic. That was not the one. Alright, let me go selfie mode on this side hit again. Dude, that guy just did a flip over there. Dang, missed a flip to the stream. Go, 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 go! Look at these, these are straight up jumps. They're not even. and it was hard. You want me to get you on a run through or um, are you mushy like us? Yeah, all right, you can get me. It's up to you. I'll, I'll hit some features. Just know this is her first day. Yeah, and guys, disclaimer, I haven't hit these first two features in like hours and now they're bald yeah. and scary. So I'm and, gonna try to not die. And legs hurt. Legs really hurt after mass time out. Fuck, I hope I'm a good filmer. Build right in front of her, so she slowed down. I but she made it. Well. Right, you handled that very professionally. Yeah, oh yeah. There you go. Yes, and that one's crooked to the left, and it's hard to get it all the way. Nice, nice. That was beautiful. Yeah, hopefully, got it. She probably is going to fire me. I hope I didn't. Don't tell her. They got busy all of a sudden. Okay, we got a little smally box right here, but the Not do it no more. Shout out to my mom. Shout out to my big brother Adam. <laughs> out in Bali. Oh when that guy fell in front of me on that first feature, I tried to just stall as long as I could on the top. I'm like, I'm like, please get up, please get up, please get up. <laughs> it was. You did good at it too, though. You were <laughs> <laughs> and you, you did, you totally and, you, and you were safe, even if, yeah, yeah you were safe. Oh, that was a good move. Yeah. He was safe, he was safe. Yeah. Well, I was aware of where he was, and like, because someone said, don't pull a Gwyneth Paltrow. But like, when I saw him fall, I knew how long it was going to take for me to get to him, and I had like a contingency in my head of like, okay, if he does not get up by the time I land this, I'm landing hard on my heel and I'm just going to go away, which 
beginner or intermediate riders cannot do. But if you have enough board control, you can like control how to get out of scary situations in the last couple of years. Yeah. Well, and like, and I and I had that. I knew what the exit was. Like, okay, if he is still there. I can get out to the left without hitting him. If he gets up straight, I can like always land and like throw this card on the brakes. Yeah. I am never worried about me running into other people because even if someone falls right in front of me on a feature, like I know how to get out of it without hitting him. But I am terrified of other people hitting me because a lot of people do not have that clip and I'm so scared someone else running into me. Hey, ask your viewers if anybody in Mammoth has a jacuzzi, we're gonna go and spike. <laughs> No, I got a few. I know where they're at. I know at least seven of them. Vinny to the case says, fly over Philly for drunk versus sober at FDR tomorrow. What is that? I don't know what that is. Vinny to the case, scream like R2-D2. Did I scream like R2-D2? Was that what I was you going through? Like that? I don't know. I can't what remember. What does he make a sound like? <laughs> I am not really sure. That might have been Ava. Ava's screaming. Raul says, I'm scared. Of, I'm afraid of heights, so Skeela feels scary for me. I sometimes trip out. Like, if, sometimes I get a little bit nervous. If there's any wind, I definitely pull the bar down. Chair 22. That's yeah, there's remember. a chair, like, back there that just goes straight up. Or no, wait, 23. 23. You're right. 23. Yeah, 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 that one goes just, like, straight up over the face, and it's just, like, two-seater, tiny, and, like, the bars that hold up are literally, like, at an angle like that. It's so scary. Oh, Send it. Uh oh. Remember you did that? Nate Webster says best opening live stream so far except the pushing out last year's snow at Levi Finland. I know that's in any case, FDR Skate Park, a six skater built skate park under bridge. You're doing a yearly drum for sober competition where you need a drink and skate or not a fever prize pool. That's funny. Um, Alright, guys, I just got a notification that my phone is at 20%. So we're going to end this here on the chairlift. It's been lovely riding with you. I hope you enjoy opening day. Um, before I go, enjoy this run full of people. Terrifying. Collision City just waiting to happen. But uh, yeah, no that's gonna be it for now. I'll see you guys another time. Let me know if you like this live stream and uh, I can do more like this. Bye!